Welcome to CB130J, Introduction to Engagement Application Development in Java. So what are you going to build in this course? Something immediately useful, a REST API for managing your data in Couchbase. You'll be mapping standard REST verbs, put, get, post, and delete, to corresponding repository methods in the lab code to create, read, update, and delete documents, which in turn will rely on insert, get, replace, upsert, and remove methods in the Couchbase SDK, as well as on the query method. Following typical Java practice, you'll work with local domain objects, POJOs, which will be serialized to and from JSON. Along the way, we'll also be looking a bit at executing nickel queries, using cluster-wide counters, and optimistic locking. There are 12 lessons in this course. We'll start off by getting Couchbase installed along with related files and tools you'll use during the course. Then we'll step you through creating a bucket, adding a single test document, verifying your setup by testing whether you can access this document through the solution code for the labs, then importing 5,000 additional documents using the new CB import tool. And once that's done, we'll begin walking through the fundamentals, starting with connecting to a cluster and opening a bucket. You'll get and deserialize a JSON document, then serialize and insert JSON. We'll cover the basics of executing nickel via the Java SDK. Then we'll update an existing document, followed by alternately inserting or updating a technique known as an upsert. We'll finish off the basic tour by removing documents, then look at using cluster-wide counters to ensure unique document IDs. Last, we'll cover how CAS, or check and set values, are useful for managing optimistic locking. To finish, we'll recommend next steps for your learning. Now, we are making some assumptions about what you already know, of course. We assume you know Java, and are familiar with Eclipse, even if you choose to use another tool for your own lab work, it's just we'll use Eclipse for demonstrations. We also assume you have basic familiarity with Couchbase, which you can get easily through other free online courses here, CB20 on the fundamentals of engagement data management, CB30 on the essentials of understanding Couchbase, and possibly CB110, our introduction to the Nickel query language. We also assume you've got a basic understanding of REST APIs. Here's a good tutorial if you'd like to take a look at them in general before jumping into this course. We've got a lot ahead. Stick around.